Western Australia, way up north, is this wonderful area called Kimberley. It's an almost completely pristine environment. It's completely untouched by um, human development. Uh, in the western part of that is a massive humpback whale carving ground. It's the, it's the biggest one in the world. Right at this location, uh, a big Australian company called Woodside, along with multinational partners and the West Australian government, is proposing a mega gas facility, the second biggest in the world so far, and a massive international seaport, which will very much displace those whales, pollute their waters, and introduce thousands of ship movements every year, year with all of the dangers to life that that brings. Sea Shepherd's purpose here would be to show people directly what all of us would lose if Woodside's project were to proceed. Sitting in a small boat and have the mother whale come up and down straight towards the boat and then go around the end of it and her car bringing its tail over. That's an experience I'll take with me for every day of the rest of my life. Seeing the whales today, again, off James Price Point, mothers, babies, bull whales, seeing the count uh, going up into the thousands of these whales, the assurance that they'd be okay with a mega port, with mega gas ships, with a huge factory ashore, is now clearly proven wrong. Whale nurseries being intact and, uh, and unscathed by modern industrial development, it should be kept free. This, this nursery can't go somewhere else, but that gas factory can. Since departing the Kimberley Coast, we've certainly seen a much higher profile for the issue in the press. So for the first time, the, the status of the Kimberley Coast is a talking point and it's, it's something that we're aware of throughout the country. It's become a national concern.